when I read the mystery of the Shemitah, I said, oh, well, uh, 2015 is going to be a very scary year. And so far, it's exceeded my expectations based on, you know, we're talking about economically, foreign policy, wars de developing, ISIS, uh, the economy's falling apart, political chaos, too. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, you know, how much of this did you foresee? Well, I think I think it's it's significant in the first the first week of the Shemitah, and, and generally the the pattern is, and we're not being dogmatic that things have done, but the pattern is that generally things happen. The dramatic part comes at the end. However, there are often foreshadows of the beginning. The first week of the Shemitah, people didn't realize it. Russia became the number one nuclear power, surpassed America. The second week of the Shemitah, the American age that began in 1871 as the the greatest economic power on earth came to an end as China took the crown, which that I've been warning about for a long time, that, that the crown would be passed. And one of the things about the Shemitah is not only linked to the economy, but also history, the rise and fall of nations. So to me, that's very ominous. One is what you're watching with America has been blessed because of God, and now it's, it's driving God and his ways out. What's going to happen to America? And then you have America and Israel, another, another law of, of ancient times, and then then you have these signs. I mean, that was major. This, the, the, this is the end of the American age. We're watching it happen. So I, I believe it's all coming. Whether it happens in the exact parameters or not, it's coming.